So this is my latest iMac G4 mod. This is the 20 inch version of the iMac G4. This actually uses the 20 inch Apple cinema display. It is actually the 20 inch Apple cinema display, which is the monitor connected to the neck and then connected to the base. So just looking at the overall setup, a couple things. Uh, this is not an all in one. This is connected to the uh, old, the, the previous generation iMac mini, uh, which you can see on the left. Also next to that, behind the Apple Pro speakers, you can see the PowerWave, the Griffin PowerWave adapter. Uh, it is the Griffin PowerWave adapter, which is actually a uh, USB adapter, which allows use of the uh, Apple Pro speakers on uh, different computers besides the uh, native iMac G4. So just looking around it, a uh, couple things you see is that the screen is quite trans-reflective. That's a little bit of a quality uh, f that is uh, conveyed by the fact that it has a five-wire resistive touchscreen. And that's one of the reasons why it is so reflective. Looking around the side, uh, you can see that this is actually, this is the Apple Cinema display. The, uh, the actual thickness uh, of the monitor is uh, identical to the native iMac G4. And interestingly enough, the weight is actually identical as well. So again, uh, you can see the silver on top and that this is actually the Apple Cinema display. Again, just coming around uh, the other side, this is actually the uh, touch screen. And now walk you around the back. You can see uh, clearly that this is actually the silver back of the uh, Apple Cinema display. One thing to note, the monitor does connect directly into the back. It is not attached to any VESA plate. It is attached to a plate inside, which is actually from the native iMac G4. Here is actually the cable for the uh, uh, five wire resistive touchscreen. Eventually I'm gonna to try to hide this under the bezel, but it does require lengthening the ribbon cable. I'm experimenting with that, but I do plan to uh, hide this more. The uh, connector for the touchscreen does uh, come out of one of the FireWire display uh, ports uh, on the monitor, which I sacrificed in order to allow the uh, touchscreen cable to come out. Let's look at the connectors. Uh, looking down here, you can see that there are really three connectors that I have uh, uh, kind of set up in the back. One is a DVI. Uh, the second one uh, in the middle is uh, simply the power connector. This connects to the native um, Apple Cinema Display power brick, which is actually contained within the base. So this is a simple AC plug. And there is a, um, a USB uh, hub in, inside the base. So this is actually uh, connected to uh, USB cable, which then connects to the Mac uh, Mini.